All our problem is um, lack of connection. Through our lack of connection, all the systems we are studying in the, in the scroll of Esther are all those disturbances are disappearing. The main thing is the action of Amalek or Haman in the case of Purim. It is to awaken us towards connection. This is basically what he wants to do. This is his role in creation, to evoke us towards a connection. However, not in the manner of him pressuring us and forcing us to unite, say, all our enemies of the all the anti-Semitism, uh, they're not coming and yelling, well, event, uh, get together, you know, how good would that be? Had they um, uh, obliterated us to, to connect or forces us? Rather, they say, well, destroy, we'll eradicate you, you're disturbing, etc. So, we need to understand that all the um, this pressure is because we need to understand the entire system of providence and the purpose of creation. What is it precisely? And that the connection between us as a reply to those external pressures of Haman, Amalek, right? Our, our, our connection, our bonding is the only uh, reply that truly immediately works because by our bonding below, we're immediately awakening the entire system. The entire system, we need to do nothing, uh, the Jews need to do nothing, uh, as in uh, Shoshan, the, the capital, as it was told in the scroll of Esther. Rather, that is enough. If they are connecting, they are activating the system. Right? So that's it.